new this morning at 632, a baby recovering in the hospital after she was found injured and alone in a shed in Livingston. Well, sadly, police believe she was left there after a crash. ABC 13's Bree Berry is live in the newsroom in Bree. Thankfully, a husband and wife found this precious baby. A husband and wife who made sure to take care of that little girl. They think that she was in the shed for at least three hours before their dog Archie started barking and creating a fuss, making them look inside their shed. But of course, what they saw, not what they were expecting. They said after calling 911, the little girl who you see in these photos that we've blurred her face, they said she had bruises around her face and was found inside the backyard shed laying on her stomach between a file cabinet and a motorcycle. Immediately when they picked her up, she went to sleep in their arms. Police believe that little girl was injured in a crash that happened earlier Saturday morning. So how did she end up in the McLean shed? Well, they used their own security camera footage to rewind several hours before where a man believed to be her father was seen putting her into the shed and then trying the doors of four vehicles along their street before stealing a neighbor's street truck. I just wrapped her in a towel and ended up just taking her up and just holding her and just making sure she was okay and safe and it was just a pretty traumatic experience and poor little baby was just just went right to sleep in my arms. We mentioned those bruises, right? Well, that wasn't it. She was actually taken by Life Flight here to Houston, where she was taken to Texas Children. She had to undergo surgery for a broken leg. She ended up with some pins, but we are told she's doing okay. Now, as far as the man believed to be her father, why he put her in that shed, any details about the crash, we are following up today with Livingston PD, trying to get those answers for you, as many people are concerned about this story. But again, just so thankful that a loving couple was able to find this little girl. We'll keep you updated. In the newsroom, Bree Berry, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.